You guys are always on the lookout for healthy recipes and today's collaboration is going to deliver you one of the best. To do that and to help us along, we have the brilliant Roz Purcell, model, author, all round amazing person basically. That was probably the best intro I've ever had. Yes! I, feel like, I feel like I need to bring you everywhere with me. So what are we going to make? So today we're going to be making some delicious healthy brownies mm -hmm. with white chocolate chunks. And we're going to finish it all off with a really nice avocado frosting. Oh, you are speaking my language. Okay, what do I need? What can I help you with? Okay, so, oh God, I'm not used to having people in the kitchen with me. I'm not going to lie. Just don't get in the way. Okay. Here, you take there yeah. and I'll, I'll, st I'll just stand over in the corner. Okay, no, come on, come on. You need to help me out. So um, what we're going to start off with is we're just going to melt our raw cacao butter. Yep. I'm going to pop in my cashew nut butter. Okay, so you've got the cashew nut butter, we've got the cocoa cacao butter. Yeah. <laughs> and we're just going to stir it around until they're all kind of combined, that there's no separation between the okay. two. Now, you guys have to check out Roz's website. It's called Natural Born Feeder. Natural Be Natural Natural Born Born Feeder. Naturalbornfeeder.com. Yeah, dot com. <laughs> and it's full of recipes like this, really healthy, but lots of like dirty healthy food. Like I saw you yeah. post a, a recipe for like a Snickers, a healthy Snickers. Protein bar. Well, you know what? Protein bar. Like, I love really, really rich indulgent food. Something you look like, like you do, oh, Ross. No, I really yeah. enjoy it. No, I really enjoy it. You know, from years of modeling, it's just something I kind of realized, oh, I can have my cake and eat it too. Yeah, I'm exactly the same. Yeah. After all my years of modeling, um, you know, this is the sort of thing I don't do at all. <laughs> I've let myself go. So I'm just going to throw in my maple. Okay. Once it's all melted together, it has a really nice kind of caramel color. Uh, we're going to pop it into our Okay. This, our lined baking tin here, and I know it's a really nice kind of caramel colour. You're like, how is this going to turn into white chocolate? But believe me, it does. It does. I believe you. I yeah, believe, believe you. me. <laughs> Have faith in me. So essentially, this is your chocolate bar. You this just is my chocolate do bar. Whatever you like. This is your, my chocolate Love bar. It. You can put it into molds, do whatever you like. But okay. It's perfect. So you can set that off to the freezer. Okay. I'll go off yeah. and do that. You tell okay. them how to do this. <laughs> okay. So what we're going to do next is we're going to go into our brownie mix. Um, we have some. Our main ingredient here is some delicious medjool dates. Now medjool dates are nature's candy. They're so fantastic. So we're going to pop these in. And I have the chocolate bar that has already frozen. In that time, oh, it took whoa. me to get to the oh, freezer. And back, we have one, it's frozen. <laughs> yeah, we did have yeah. this prepared. Already, yeah. so. Okay, right, so you've got your medjool dates. So we have our medjool dates. So you're going to pop them into the... Okay. We've got a food, processor, food processor going on. So we'll move a ground almonds. Okay, a lot of passing and pouring. Yeah. Ground almonds go in. Raw cacao uh -huh. powder. And then we have our two bananas. Two bananas, okay. Yeah. Now, just straight in with the peel off. Straight in. Oh, no, 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 you're going to take the peel off. <laughs> take the peel off. Okay, you're really yeah. trying to mess up the dressing. I'm just room. seeing, you know, yeah. if you're, you're still there. You're yeah. like, are you listening? Are you listening? <laughs> and then lastly, just a little half a teaspoon of baking powder. Baking powder, okay. Yeah. Is that it now? That's it. That's it, wow. That's like, all you got. Just a few ingredients. Yeah. And this and we're is essentially. Blitz it up. Blitz it up, and this yeah. will give us our brownie mixture. This will give us a really nice gooey brownie Ross, mixture. I am very excited about yeah. this. Okay, let's. Oh, we need to plug in the mixer. We. Let's okay, turn it, it on. by now. Oh yeah, that's perfect. Yeah. Really nice. You can see it's kind of nice and gooey. Very nice and smooth. Looking, oh my god, I love this. It's my it's tiny like spatula. Your tiny, tiny spatula. <laughs> I feel it's like I should ants. be like I should be like I should like tiny, tiny motion. Maybe like, we should make tiny brownies. <laughs> yeah, make a tiny, tiny portion. So you're gonna pop it into um, a okay. bowl here, and I'm just gonna break up our chocolate. It's kind of a, a very stiff mixture. But very uh, stiff <laughs> mixture. That's why I gave you the job. We're gonna break all the chocolate up into really kind of large, large chunks. Am I gonna have to now mix this through? Yes, you are. This is, I really, I think I'm yeah. actually going to get the muscles from this recipe. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> it's a mix that you can kind of take it out with your hands now and kind of press it okay. down into the tin. Do you want me to do that now? Yeah, yeah, okay, yeah. Right. <laughs> well, it's pretty shocking. Getting you're, getting, you're getting all the fun jobs today. Okay, so I think I've, I've mushed this down as much as I possibly okay. can. Are you yeah, happy with that? Fantastic, yeah. And now we're going to set this off the oven for about 25 minutes. So okay. it's going to get really nice, kind of crunchy and crispy on top, yeah. but still really gooey on the inside. Our brownie has come out of the oven. It's and cooled. It smells, smells so good. <laughs> so good. <laughs> so good. So for our frosting, yeah. we have some avocados. Nice ripe avocados. Yeah, nice ripe avocados. I want a big knife, yes. <laughs> I'd, like, knife. I'd like a giant knife. Now this it's frosting, nice. uh, this is, I actually have made these uh, chocolate avocado puddings on this channel. So it's kind of similar mixture and you can actually use it as a frosting as well. Yeah. Okay, so we've got nice ripe avocados. and now Delicious ripe our... avocados. Now we have some, uh, once again, some raw cacao powder. Raw cacao powder. So similar kind of uh, Similar kind of ingredients, you know. So all cashew in all, butter. you don't need that many in your pesto. See, there you go. There okay. You go. Uh, we have some cashew butter, yep. and on the recipe you can use any type of nut butter you want. Okay. You know, we've used some cashew nut butter already in the recipe, so throw it in. And then lastly, now you can use maple syrup, you can use honey, you can use agave, just layer it on. That looks really good. And then it's just a case of blitzing up. Okay, we're done. We're done! <laughs>
Wow. It looks so good. It looks um, like something you'd find in the toilet. Yeah, but, uh, yeah it, it does. It <laughs> does. As, as chocolate frosting does. Maybe go okay. over to her channel. Yeah. She'll describe these things better. Much better. <laughs> uh, so, so we're going to pop this up here. Okay. I'm we're really excited about the dolloping. The dollop it okay. on. Blop. Oh. That looks so good. Yum. I, I think we need to now cut it and try it. We really do. <laughs> yeah. I'm going to give you the honours. Okay, I get the honours. I, I want a raw style portion. Wow, look at that. Sorry, I just got distracted by how fudgy this looks. Yeah. This looks so good. So Monstrous portions, but so good. So, so I yum. think you should come and cook Cheers. in the kitchen. Cheers. Bye. Mmm. Mm. That is so, so good. <laughs> it is. Oh. My, one of my favourite recipes. Do you know what? Like, you see those ingredients, you think, how is this going to be anything like a brownie? But it is, it is possibly one of the better brownies I've tried. It's got this fudginess, this really rich chocolateiness, and there's absolutely no butter, sugar, Nothing. or any of the bad stuff. This is what Roz's recipes are all about. If you like the look of this brilliant brownie, you can check it out in the box below. You also have this recipe video on your channel, and I want you to go over and subscribe to Roz's Brilliant Channel. It's only at its starting point, but there's lots more brilliant recipes on it our way, aren't there? She's, she's busy eating. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, go over and check her out eating. Um, if you like this video, make sure to like, subscribe to this channel for lots more delicious recipes. And of course, we'll see you soon. Thank you for coming Thank and showing me this brilliant brownie. <laughs>